Buy it. Ready? She's just she's in disagreement face right now. This is woman blueprint woman disagreement arguing i am not capable of re being wrong she's here loading a bunch of nonsense ready to disagree with the question i don't even remember what the question is but you see it man i hate men i hate men more accepting of women who can sell sex but are less likely to accept a man who can buy it because it's empowering to be able to do what you want with your body when you want to be able to do it okay so do whatever you want, you're empowered. You see the, the, see the crazy guys right now? When I talk about delusion, when I talk about feminist brainwashing, this is it, crazy eyes. Empow this is empowering eyes. Delusion in her face right now. Chad, have you ever made this face to a question? When's the last time you, this is the face of somebody going crazy, but the world accepts so much craziness that this is normal now, but you look insane. But isn't that like shaming your own customers? No. Look at that face. Well, can't look, look, look at that face. But isn't that like... When I make that face, you say I'm in my Joker era. Crazy, right? I look crazier than her. You just accept it from her. So yeah, I might be a little crazy. I might be a little loud, wild on my stream. But when someone does this in public, check her. Say you look crazy. Like shaming your own customers? No. Well, how can you be a victim of your own product? Because it's my fucking body. That didn't answer the question. Okay. My body, my choice. That, that you just, you just, you're just saying stuff that you read online. My body, my choice has nothing to do with the, what the question is. He's asking like... My body, my choice. Yes, I heard this online and I'm empowered by these words that make no sense. All right, you know what's so funny? They say my body, my choice. They also took every single booster shot. You know, I know this, they're bots. My body, my choice, but they said, well, you have to get the shot. You have to get the shot, but I can kill all the babies if I want to, but also you have to get the booster. Fucking idiot. Why do women often claim victimhood by the very thing they use to empower themselves? I believe in that question. I do believe that. Women do, they do that me too shit, and I don't believe in that. Like, you you say you want to, like, empower yourself and then use this as, like, you know, like a beneficial factor, but then, you you know, you claim victim. And I, I think it's just a money, it's just a money aspect. That women are okay being objectified as long as they're getting paid. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Do you see how they're honest right now? Because they haven't been questioned by 10 other it's complicated incel questions beforehand. So they're ready to be honest. But when women get emotional, they have to be right. They are incapable of saying anything that makes sense. Now it's a fight. That's how, that's sparring for them. That's why those last two feminists made a bunch of bullshit answers and they said, no, 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 women empowerment, my body, my choice. Because feminism is telling you that men are bad and women are good. But right now these girls are calm, sober, and they are capable of rational thought. But when women get emotional, it's impossible. Do you consider sex work to be real work? No, there you go. She now they're making sense. Is she gonna disagree? Come on, you look kind of pretty. Don't say something. Well, yeah, for porn stars and OnlyFans, cause they get that dough. They get they're millionaires off OnlyFans. Why is porn legal but prostitution isn't? Tell me that. Why? Why? And tell me this. Why can you go out and have sex with 20 million men for free and then nothing happens? But as soon as you want to put a price on your worth, it's illegal. Hello. That's the question. It's almost like they don't want you to have interactions. It's almost like they want you to just be online and get weaker and dumber and they don't want you to connect with other people. Do you believe all even if you pay for it? Adults have sexual needs. Yeah. Of course. Of course. And you couldn't Buy live a life. You could not live life without sex. <laughs> bye bye man. <sighs> Shit. You got competition chat. It's impossible. Should lonely men be expected to satisfy their sexual needs by watching porn? Yes and no. If they're really desperate, then yes. But if they can wait for a woman, then they should not watch porn. Just, Chad, just don't watch porn in general. It's just terrible for you. It's the worst thing right now for your mental health. They can. If, that, if, that's, their, if, that's, if that's what they want, then I think that it, it should go that way. Or by prostitutes. If so, why would men still crave sex when porn is free and available all over the internet? Because we need human interaction. Because you don't get the... You know how long it takes for you to find the right porn? 
Because women don't understand that men actually are more horny than women themselves. And they I'm drunk, I'm putting it No, we're equally amount of horny. They actually need a sex life, otherwise they cannot function at all. And I know that because I've had like ex-boyfriends that cannot live without sex. Do you consider sex work to be real work? Not really, no. But do you think most women consider sex work to be real work? Yo, W Young Don. This is Young Don without the YouTube channel. Yeah, the empowerment thing, trying to you know make it sound like it's more than it is, so that they can feel good about it, kind of thing. But I, I don't, I don't believe it is real work at all. Why are women more accepting of women who can sell sex, but are less likely to accept a man who can buy it? Ooh, that's a that's a good question. More double standards. It's just they don't like reality very much. Isn't that shaming your own customers? Yep. E yeah, I, I believe so. Yeah. Isn't that like complaining about crackheads while you're selling crack? Exactly the same, yeah. <laughs> but no accountability for them. If prostitution was legal, do you think we'd have a better society? Ooh. I mean, it worked for thousands of years. Isn't prostitution the oldest profession? Not really, to be honest with you. I can't, I can't say I think we'd be better as a society at all. Not really. Yes, I do consider sex work is real work. We're the work of all time. We're gonna last longer than any other- Oh, you a sex worker? industry we've been here all before okay and we're still gonna be here hey how much how much was on top dm me i just want to know the price i'm not gonna buy it when computers and everything take over they're still gonna want a physical woman to get it done okay we're gonna be here if prostitution was